So my name's Sai, I work at Bingo Hall uh, and I'm recently like learning like different things about the place, so like how it all works and that. I've been there for a year now and a bit. I'm a bit of a slow learner, <laughs> if that makes sense. Uh. I'd say 2013, I'd say I started like getting work opportunities because before I didn't really have an agency or anything like I did some things that went viral because everyone was getting me confused with their cheering and stuff like that because everyone was telling me that oh my god you look just like him you should uh, be a lookalike. Not much wind anyway. So we're doing an interview today and it's going to be fun. We're going to go to Manchester and is it Manchester and or is it? I've forgotten where it is. <laughs> uh, it's somewhere anyway, and hopefully I'll get some footage on that. I can hear the wind again. I do like vlogging and YouTube and stuff like that, and the one thing that motivates me, it's pretty weird, is I had this um, this manager that was really jealous on what I did. Like, say if, uh, I'd tell him, I'd be like, I need some time off, like in a few weeks time, I've got a part for a film or something like that. He'd get jealous and say, you're going to get the sack for it, you're going to get this. And I just didn't like that and I thought I'm going to switch to something else where I can be sort of my own boss sort of thing. So I used the YouTube as like another outlet. So if I get a few views and do the revenue and all that, then I could make a bit of money from that. Man, now this place is really busy. We just got stopped and asked if it was Ed Sheeran. First time today. Maybe I might get it in a vlog. I don't even know if you can hear me on the mic, so... Anyway, time to find my station. Usually like I'd just wear comfy clothes and stuff and then if I do have an appearance or a gig then I'd wear like the jeans and stuff like that and the tartan shirts. I do like to wear jeans like when I'm going out and stuff if I want to be more smart than just lounging around the house sort of thing. I do like the normal lifestyle because then I can do things that I want to do rather than have a manager like oh you've got to go there, you've got to go there. You've got to have um, security guards constantly, you don't get any of your own space and stuff like that. And just because they're good at something or because they're icon about something, I don't feel like someone should be isolated from the rest of the world. What makes them different to everyone else? They're just good at something, you know what I mean? I take appreciation in, I don't want to be that person that turns down selfies because if someone wants a selfie with me, like, I'd feel it's best for me to decide, which I prefer, like, if it makes people stay or it makes people happy and it does things like that, I prefer to, like, take the selfie with them rather than having someone to say what I've got to do and stuff like that. My maths teacher once told me, you'll never be successful in life without maths. But I said, I am. Think about Ed's albums, plus, multiply, divide. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Every time one of them comes out, I've got a bit of a paycheck coming in, so I can't complain. <laughs>